guys welcome back to my channel so this is my official holiday vlog and i'm so excited to be here i'm a little bit tanned because yesterday when we arrived i was so tired we had some food went to sleep and then today i was just like i just want to tan and just relax and not think about anything but here i am i'm gonna start my vlog from now but I want to tell you where I am and I'm in Lanzarote. The reason why I wanted to come back to Lanzarote is because I was here five years ago. Can't believe it, it's such a long time. But it was my first vacation with my boyfriend. And just looking back, I had no money. I had nothing. I would say it was probably the lowest time of my life. And when i came i loved it even though we stayed at such a cheap little hotel and we kind of hated it but we end up going to such a nice place called playa blanca and there was a hotel there and i said to my boyfriend at the time like when i have money and when i'm like settled and everything's going well i'm gonna come back here and i'm gonna stay in a five-star hotel and live life to the fullest and i remember saying that to him and here i am five years later when my life has completely changed drastically all my hard work has paid off slowly and i'm here i always think like as much as you should work extra hard you should also take time off and reflect and enjoy life and this is why i make an effort to go on holidays and make trips like this so yeah, I'm so happy I'm here and I'm gonna quickly show you the view I'm looking at right now because it is incredible before the sun completely goes but look guys let me show you how beautiful my view looks and then the sun is completely going and look at the mountains I'm gonna get ready so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna wear and yeah I'm ready so I'm wearing this black top and these leather trousers from Zara. But guys, this is what I wanted to show you. How amazing is this bathroom? It's got a bath here with the vanity. This mirror is so big. I love it so much. So, taxi and we're going to a steak restaurant, which is four minutes away. things because I, it's like a psychological problem I choked when I was younger and I never ate meat from that day onwards and it's not that I don't like it it's just it gets stuck in my throat and then I just get scared so I don't eat anymore so anyways I got some ribs and he got some just a normal steak guys look I'm hoping my mate is wow that is a whole rack of ribs now this is actually so nice and he was like you have youtube and i'm like yeah and then he was like come let's just do some cocktails and he started to record on his phone it was kind of funny <laughs> don't think i'm that crazy it's just i'm up for anything that is fun but yeah that was really fun and the food over here is so ridiculously cheap we had some pancakes they were amazing would you believe that they're 350 three euros but anyways i'm gonna take my makeup off and get ready for bed and then bring you on tomorrow <music> okay so we're now going to the gym i quickly got changed we had a nap in the rooftop and i'm gonna start chatting shit now <laughs> but i'm gonna take you to gym bye <laughs> So 
guys, we have finished our gym session. We're really hungry. We don't like the food in the hotel. It's like the most basic food. We rather just experiment because we have half board, so we would end up eating the same thing for the next seven days. We do so. We want to go to that restaurant and we have to google it and see the reviews because we have been to so many restaurants without looking at the reviews and then we have the worst food or the worst customer service and then we free. and then we end up walking out just so unhappy so you just before you go to a restaurant always check the reviews guys look how big this piece of salmon is and my peas with a bit of sauce so i'm back in the hotel and i look a bit crazy but I'm gonna put some makeup on because my face is so pale. This is the longest place for it to catch a tan. Like, and when I take pictures, it just my face just looks white and I have a really dark body. I arrived three days ago and I've not done absolutely nothing of work. My boyfriend's upstairs already in the rooftop pool. Hopefully there's no one there. Guys, okay, so this is the rooftop. That hairstyle. What was the point of me doing my hair, please? <laughs> That's so annoying. Guys, I am... I'm so annoying. I locked myself out, literally just going back into the room. And I had to come all the way downstairs. There was no way of me calling my boyfriend because I left my phone inside the room. I'm so annoying. I'm actually so annoyed. I'm not even going to tell him because he... Every time I tell him I do some like some something dumb like this, he tells me off because it just has to happen to me. It only happens to me. Oh. Come in. It's okay. Well, you. you sure? Yeah. Awkward. This is I'm gonna take the pic right here with that beautiful background. Guys, so it is a few hours later. I did my makeup, I forgot to vlog, but I was just doing TikTok videos and some content. So we're gonna go to a restaurant again, discover a new one. I'm not even sure where we're going. We're just gonna go and explore. I just wanna quickly show you my outfit because I think it's really cool. Let me just try and put this down. Give me a sec. <laughs> okay, let me go and put my heels on, wait. Here I am. Outfit of the day from Ruth. It is like a French brand, I'm not really sure, but I love this two piece. Ready to go out. Guys, so we're gonna do the funniest thing ever. So it's like a 10 minute walk, and we just wanna have fun. We see all these people with like little scooters. Can you see them? Yeah. So there's a few here, and then we're gonna get the app and actually do it. I'm bare dressed up, but life is so short we just need to have fun look they're right here <laughs> 10 minute is gonna be like about five minute little drive to the restaurant <laughs> you scan the barcode just like that and then you pay for it oh, go <gasps> go look it's ready go how'd you do this how'd you do it i have no idea <laughs> it says kick and then start kick oh <laughs> oh. I don't know how I'm vlogging guys, look at me. <laughs> Clearly you're lost because I don't know where the hell we are. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put the camera down. I'll see you when I get to the <laughs> restaurant. Guys, it's closed. Because of this idiot, didn't even check. And we got lost and we're here like I don't know what to do. So where are you going to take me, hey? Guys, you know how long that ride was? 24 minutes, because this idiot was just doesn't even know how to do directions for six euros. So it's not too bad, but I'm so hungry. Do you know how late it is now? Cheers to hard work. Cheers. So we was just taking a picture and the electricity went. I think in the whole island. Because everything's dark outside. How are we gonna eat? Is it so they can still cook? <laughs> and we're so hungry. Oh my god, just our luck. There's no light outside. Like, it's pitch black. 
guys, so we just ordered the mussels. Thank God the food is still coming out because imagine mm, that looks amazing. So this is an Italian restaurant. Ready to munch this off. Guys, can you hear everyone celebrating? The lights are on. Finally. Thank you. <laughs> look, look at the man. Without hot, guys. <laughs> it's very hot to cook. Uh, <laughs> So they were cooking without no aircon, imagine that. Now we can relax and take some pictures. Yay! I was literally in the middle of taking a picture and then my face is like, because <laughs> it turned off literally as he was taking the picture. It's so funny, let me show you the picture actually. Look at the picture. <laughs> That's my face when <laughs> the lights turn off. Guys, look at my pasta. <laughs> Oh my god, amazing. Hey guys, so it's currently 4.30 in the afternoon on the next day. And honestly, I did not bother vlogging last night because we was kind of tipsy after everything we went through. It was actually so funny. We made so many memories yesterday, so that was a funny one. Um, but now we are going to shoe. It's so hot today. It honestly feels like 40 degrees, but... Oh, it's hot. I'm super tanned. I want to show you the rest of my hotel because I didn't even know how beautiful it was until we walked out to discover a little bit more because it's so big. So enjoy the next clips. currently about to be nine i don't know if you can see quickly show you my outfit hold on oh. hold on oh. there was a fly <laughs> um but this blazer suit i'm into blazers and i just want to look a little bit older now that i'm 25 i want to change my style a little bit but yeah cropped up from roof shop on instagram and this blazer two-piece from Zara because there's a fancy restaurant Asian restaurant downstairs in the hotel so we're gonna just we're just gonna walk down and have some dinner guys so we literally come from our room and the restaurant is right here it's so beautiful here so yeah guys this is the first dish <laughs> Tiny restaurants, right? They always offer you like either champagne or wine, and I'm just not really a lover. I love my cocktails, but it's okay. We're gonna look how many champagne we've got one, two, three. They offer you this, like, oh, champagne, champagne, and I'm like, yeah, okay. In tissues, the next is a uh, Gurel, uh, with tuna, eh, no sorry, Gurel with avocado and king tissues. Okay. And the first is a uh, chili crab. This, uh, Thank you. This is real fine dining. She, every time they bring a meal, they literally explain exactly what's in it and how to eat it, which I've never experienced before. But, I don't know if you can see this. It's like mint with God knows what it is. This is first. Look at the oysters. And then to eat this, which I'm not sure what it is. But it's super tiny. It tastes so good. What is that? Mm. Wow. Soup. <laughs> Guys, how is the lady? Sorry, I can't even set this up. But how is the lady explaining exactly how to eat it and he just mixed the whole thing up and ate it? Oh my god. So basically she said you need to eat the onion first separately and then you mix this bit with the little brown little bits and then you eat it. 
<laughs> he literally went like this. <laughs> oh, man. Get over, get over. Yeah, I can tell. Mm, what is that? That is weird. They better bring me some fish and chips. <laughs> this smells incredible. Pull up already, but yeah, this is like the fifth dish. And then these little things there. I'm sorry guys, but I have to show you this last one. Look how beautiful this looks. I thought it was the last one, but it isn't. We have one more. I need to eat the pink one. White chocolate. Well, that is sour. <laughs> guys so i didn't vlog today but we are currently in a restaurant called kentia and it's a gourmet restaurant where they serve really fine dining food yes. one prawn <laughs> this better be nice <laughs> guys ceviche in a bottle this is more like it because the other one jesus we had one prawn but tail, some salad Finally back in the room and I'm just going to take my makeup off and go to sleep. Good night guys. Guys, I'm still not tanned. It's so annoying. Why does this happen to me? Sorry about the messy hair but you see the difference? I was upstairs for three hours and nothing. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to go and get ready. We're going to go out for dinner and... As per usual, I'll show you when I might actually do my makeup with you guys because I've been just filming before I go out when I go to eat. So I might get ready with you guys for my dinner tonight. Showered. The shower in my hotel room is so big. Just realizing that I really need to stop looking into this mirror. This mirror is so zoomed in that it shows you like spots that. I didn't even know I had. I've been picking at my face and now I have like these spots. Um, I was going to show you guys this foundation. I've been using this over here. I bought it just before I came. It's pretty new. I haven't really seen people talk about it. But when I say this foundation lasts throughout anything, sweat, tears, water, I jumped into the pool with this makeup on by accident. And when I came out, my skin just still looked the same. It was crazy. It's, I think it's like a waterproof. It's called a com soft mat for the heat or holidays. You guys need to try this, honestly. Because my head, my hair looks crazy right now. I love these headbands. Also, you guys, I recommend you guys come in. If you ever get a chance to come in to Lanzarote. I literally forgot to say where i actually am puerto del carmen so it's one part of lanzarote lanzarote in itself is super small so you can actually go throughout the whole island in a car in a few hours but i think this is probably the best part because i when i last came i can't remember exactly where i was but i was in the middle of nowhere i don't feel like anyone talks about these little islands and there's so much to do you just need to know where to go so I'm going to definitely put all the restaurants that I came if you guys ever come. And you guys have to visit a few restaurants that I went to because oh, I can't believe this whole vlog is about food. It should have been just like a food vlog because Jesus, that's all I did. <laughs> but there's nothing else to do. Oh, I'm nearly finished my makeup. I had to like stop the camera because to be honest i would be here the whole day trying to chat to you guys while i do my makeup because i do take a bit long my current favorite lip combo i know you guys are gonna probably ask for it but it's vibes and then i mix leon and london together morphe lip liners are probably my favorite lip liners leon in the outer corners i kind of just blend that line and i finish off with london in the middle of my lips I just like to mix colours. 
There we go. Nice and natural. Guys, so I'm finished my makeup, my hair. I decided to do this little slip back with um, hair ties all over my hair. And it looks kind of cool. I've never done this. And yeah, this is my makeup. Mm -hmm. And we are off. I'm going to put some oil and some perfume on my skin because it's super dry. And I'm wearing this um, coloured two-piece. It kind of looks like pyjamas. So I wanted to show you guys. I am into, I think I'm into collecting luxury perfumes recently. I was in the airport and I love anything that smells like baby. I don't know why. Like powdery smells is my thing. But my boyfriend hates it. So he was like, I want you to smell different. And this lady gave us a tester of a Bulgari, if I'm reading it right. It smelled rich. Like when I say rich, like you know when you walk into the um to Harrods and these Arab ladies smell so strong, like they walk past and you're like just look at the bottle it is the most beautiful perfume i'll probably ever own and i will only wear it on special occasions because it's so expensive but i think i'm really into perfumes i would say last year i didn't own one perfume but now it's so important i think your hair makeup and the way you smell is so important so you might be seeing me obsessed with perfumes because once I get into something, I get like an obsession and I have to like collect them. I have a, like a collective personality, but just two because it's so strong. Mm. So I'm going to go and I'll catch you in the restaurant. flavors like this together and make it into like an explosion into your mouth it's just unreal I, l I would love to be able to cook like this because even though I love food like this your girl cannot cook maybe when I move out I'm gonna have to learn I probably will like it because I love food that much but I probably poisoned my boyfriend in the first year Guys, look how nice this is. It's like truffle cake with coconut. We just paid for the bill. We ordered two. Sorry for me ordered. We've got cocktails, three starters, even dessert, two mains, wine. A hundred and twenty-two euros, and then I paid in pounds, and it came up to a hundred and eight pounds. Do you think we could ever get? everything we got and the quality of it in london never never in a million years anyways guys i would recommend you guys visiting lanzari for this reason it's so so cheap everywhere you go food is so delicious and you save so much money if you was to just have just mains and a drink i swear to god the, the meal would be 40 euros or even 30 and if you see this location, it's like Nobu, like type of vibe. Hey guys, so it's the next day. It's currently 13 past three. And I'm gonna go to my, the most amazing place. And the reason why I came back to Lanzarote is because of this. We rented a car, it's waiting for us downstairs. And I'm a bit nervous to drive because the drive over here is kind of scary. But you guys ready? scenery it's, it's like a hole like it's almost like a cliff 
you know what it's such an experience we've never actually done like rock climbing or we're usually lazy we just try to get a car and just drive to places but this is so nice walking around seeing the scenery it's so beautiful and now we're gonna go down to the beach before the sun hits again Hey guys so we have been at the beach for a few hours and i just want to we just want to stay here to see the sunset it's about to set but we're so hungry and dehydrated we forgot to get water so we are dying right now <laughs> I'm drinking a mock. Um, <laughs> can't even talk. A mojito. <laughs> I forgot what I was going to say. And it's got me really tipsy. Because I have not eaten. When did we eat? Like one. In this restaurant, it's so breathtaking. It's amazing. But they don't do food. Okay, I'm drunk. I will see you later. <laughs> so I'm gonna do a TikTok, right? A little bit. <laughs> and you guys are gonna love of the things I actually do for a TikTok. I enjoy doing this, watch. <laughs> so I need the sunset, right? Let me put you down here. And men are looking at me like, what the fuck is she doing? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Guys, we got it! <laughs> this is the life of Five, yeah. living with Nats. <laughs> as much as I love pictures, he loves pictures. Actually, it's so funny. Look at him. <laughs> Are you recording me? You can't record me. Yes, I can. You're drunk. We got drunk with one cocktail. How bizarre. Guys, so it's actually getting so dark and you know that drive was the scariest drive ever there's no lights like look down there there's absolutely no lights oh shit and it's literally like sorry for the darkness but actually let me put a light on so you guys can see me it's actually like <clears throat> rocks onto rocks onto rocks like the car bounces like a little yeah there's no road it's just like land and you drive through it so i'm kind of scared through the road that i was talking about and there's so many bombs look <laughs> and it's so scary because it's actually just land like i don't even know where i'm going i'm just looking okay, down sorry this is gonna be a movie <laughs> yeah, <I know>. <laughs> we're literally everywhere. gonna be jumping up and down in the hotel quickly changed went to get up my sandals because i left them in the car it always happens to me where i have to leave something I'm so forgetful, so I'm running up and I'm going to put my sandals back into the room and then we're going to head out to get some food, Chinese food, I think we're feeling for. Guys, so this is the first time that we are on the strip and we don't usually walk, we're so lazy, we usually get the scooters or a taxi, but this is kind of cute and it's a little vibe, I don't even know how close it is to the hotel. So if you ever do come here, you have so much to pick from. So it's full of little machines, blue house, Spanish food. You can sit by the beach. <laughs> and cool. Let's try the Chinese from Spain because apparently it's different to the one in the UK. Guys, so sweet and sour chicken, noodles, pork. And special fried rice, some ribs. Mm. It's completely different. Right? Cozy. Yeah. It tastes completely different to the UK one. Completely. Even the sweet and sour sauce is like yellow. I'll show you. And back home it's like an orange kind of colour. Hey you guys, so it's the next day and yesterday we had such nice food, we fell asleep instantly but now it's the last day and we've packed all our bags, everything's literally packed and the whole apartment is clean. We're gonna have some food and try and enjoy the last day. So I will leave this vlog here, I really hope that you guys like this holiday vlog, I did try my best 
better than the last time so I'm, yeah, I am getting better but make sure you subscribe give me a like and I'll see you on my next one bye